Hello YouTube, this is PuffinPlucky76 and I'm going to be showing you how to divide with decimals. So you'd use decimals if you were dividing money or measurements. So what I'm going to do is if you want to use decimals right beside the 552 you have to add a decimal zero zero and up top here you have to ha have a d add a decimal so now we can start dividing five can go into five one time and five times one equals five so then we subtract five minus five equals zero and you bring down the five which equals five so how many times can five go into five one time five times one equals five floppy five and that's zero and that's zero so then you bring down the two now how many times can five go into two well it can't go into two so you have to put a zero there to show that it can't go into two and then you bring down this zero. Five can go into 20 40 times, or not 40, four times. And five times four equals 20. And then you subtract, and this equals zero, 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 and zero. So can five go into zero? No, it can't. So you bring down this zero, and five still can't go into zero. So you add a zero here to show that it can't go into zero. So, yeah. So what this would mean is each person would get $110.40. So if we had $552 and we wanted to divide it in five people, each person would get $110.40. So that's how you divide with money. Now, you can also do this for measuring lengths. So maybe if I had 360 meters of road and I wanted to divide that 360 meters of road into five different streets, uh, how many how much how many meters would each street get so as you can see we have to add decimal zero zero onto the end because this would mean 360 meters and zero centimeters so then you add your decimal to the top and five can go into 36 seven times 5 times 7 equals 35 and then you subtract 6 minus 5 equals 1 3 minus 3 equals 0 bring down the 0 5 can go into 10 twice 5 times 2 equals 10 and then you bring down and then you subtract 0 minus 0 equals 0 1 minus 1 equals 0 and 0 minus 0 equals 0 and 5 can't go into 0 so you have to bring down the 0 5 still can't go into 0 so you have to put a 0 right there to show that so now uh, we have to bring down this 0 and 5 still can't go into 0 so we have to put another 0 up here to so show that so really what this is saying is each road would have 72 meters and 0 centimeters of, yeah, that's the length of each road. So how, would you, how you would read this is 72.00 meters. So that means uh, 72 meters and 0 centimeters. So I hope you liked this video and I hope it helped you 
and please watch all of my other videos and yeah bye oh, there we go bye okay oh it's still recording ah okay let me okay bye